Mimir, I still don't get why you ever wanted to work for Odin. Back then, I was young enough to still be ambitious. The Aesir gods were as powerful a force as I'd come across, but they clearly lacked for strategy, focus, and sage counsel. All this could I faithfully provide. And so, a stranger from a far-off island found himself with Odin's ear, trusted as he trusted no one but himself. And with that kind of power, laddie, I must confess, there are perks. Yeah, but he's Odin. I never claim to be perfect, laddie, only clever. And often too clever by half. So what'd you do to get Odin so mad at you? Well, for a long time my job was to enable Odin, and I was fucking excellent at it. Gradually, as I grew more to care about people and the world, my job became to contain him, to protect him from himself. By serving peace, I served his interests as well, that's the truth. But he saw it as disloyalty. No longer trusting my motives, but not wishing to part with my brain or tongue, he bound me to a tree and adopted a new pastime of casual torture. Well, I'm glad we came along to cut off your head. Aye, lad. Lucky break that was.